Sony are absolutely trying to rob their fan base, and I'm here to explain why. As we know recently, The Last of Us Part 1 was remastered. It was not a remake, that shit was a copy and paste job, alright? And that shit copy and paste job featured nothing different other than some sexy lighting changes and accessibility options, which by the way, I don't know why people were celebrating, because it would be way more honourable to just put it in the original game for free. But you know, billion dollar company over here looking out for the little guy. That's the equivalent of people applauding a company for finally adding a ramp next to their staircase but in order to use it you have to pay $70. Never have I seen a company pimp out accessibility options before, truly next evolution of gaming is upon us. Good job Sony, you've smashed it mate. And of course we go even further than that, and we had Spider-Man PS4 remastered which added a whopping new face that drove the internet into so much rage that if their neighbour was violently murdered and they could hear the screams, it still wouldn't be the most saddest thing that happened to them on that day. Everyone's monsters energy drinks were knocked to the floor and their sweatpants became extra soggy when Peter went from a 40 year old pensioner to Tom Holland's body double. Both insanely pointless remakes, besides the 60 FPS boost to Spider-Man and some new suits, so at least Insomniac fucking tried, but that's like me selling a painting, taking it back, drawing a little sun in the corner, then selling it again. And now we have Horizon Zero Dawn, a game that had a fucking 60 FPS update and you can still play it on the PS5, yet it's receiving a remaster. Are you mad? At this point, the Sony equivalent of a shit would be doing the dookie shit than being like, man, I wish I could do that again, and it sucks back into your fucking ass and comes back out again so you can relive the shit. This game is still so fresh, it's fresher than a roadman with a new Adidas tracksuit, and according to this, the remaster will feature accessibility options, so well done once again for charging fucking $70. You know what I mean, like big ups for charging $70 so people can actually play your game this time. Really glad you decided to add the ramp to the stairs for old Susan before booting her down it because you didn't pay 70 fucking dollars. It'll have graphics modes and quality of life improvements to the gameplay so instead of being able to shoot your arrow, now you'll be able to shoot your arrow and get a bit more of a rumble in your fingers. Instead of playing the same game as before, you'll be playing the same game as before but like, better? What the fuck is this supposed to be for Sony? This is obviously just some scheme because Horizon and The Last of Us are getting shows. I can't wait for God of War to come to Amazon so we get to hear boy 1000 times, but this time with slightly better lighting and maybe a bit more detailed boy.